and the second last, Pop Away jumps on past Teton Power. Queen Olivia can't go with them in third. Dabbing up Mirren keeping on in fourth. Pop Away belying her 13 years has gone clear under Amy Robinson. Wing the final fence. She's five lengths in front of Teton Power with Queen Olivia keeping on the one pace back in third. But it's Pop Away who loves this good ground, who's charging up the Cheltenham Hill again. A race she won in 2016 for Pauline and Doug Harkin. Pop Away has gone on to score handsomely. Teton Power ran with great credit to be second. Queen Olivia was third and Davin at Moon stayed on to be fourth in front of Palmeria and finally Martha's Benefits. She may be 13 years old but there's no sense that the fires are dimming in Popaway's heart and having travelled like a dream and jumped beautifully by and large in the hands of Amy Robinson, she's forged her way up the Cheltenham Hill to win this race once again two years on from her previous success, a mare who's become a hardy perennial in this race. There's no hiding the delight on Amy Robinson's face and well she might smile because this, Jonathan, will be one of the more popular victories tonight. Yeah, very much. Third, third win at the meeting. Uh, you said, by and large, jump well. I thought she jumped every fence absolutely superbly. I, she's ended up in second place after a lap simply through jumping, not through any urgency to make any progress. And after that, it was just a matter of Amy Robinson waiting mm. to pounce if, if she could, which and the horse could. I and mean, that was... Oh, it's just fantastic. A 13-year-old showing that amount of zest and enthusiasm. Just wonderful.